by you. It's me. I am back from my little summer break. We'll call it summer break. Summer fling. <laughs> and um, I just wanted to kind of give you guys a quick update about what's going on in my life right now. Um, I had a great summer, and I am just now starting to settle back in, get my daughter back into life in school, and uh, I thought it would be a great time for me to start a diet. Um, I have had a few things um, be presented to me, but out of all those diets, this diet I'm going to tell you about seemed to fit me the best. Um, I go to the gym four to five times, four to five times a week for about an hour, and I've seen progress, um, but it's, it's just a little bit too slow for me. I, I'm not even going to lie, you know, I'm like, I'm busting my butt every day, I want to see progress now, but, you know, it's a, it's an instant gratification world, so who doesn't? Um, but this diet is called the HCG diet. And I know it's been this huge controversial thing, but I've known two good friends that have been on it. And uh, one's lost about 40 pounds, and my other girlfriend's lost about 50 pounds. Um, now, keep in mind, I don't have that much I want to lose. I am, <laughs> right now, I'm going to say it, right now I'm about 176, 177. My highest I've been is about 196. That's right, almost 200 pounds. Um, again, the exercising has brought me down about 15 to 20 pounds. Um, but ideally, I would like to be in the 150 range. For my height, which is 5'4 to 5'5, I'm like about 5'5, um, the 150 range is probably the most you should weigh. But for me, I like curves. I like all this. <laughs> and I want to keep all of this, but I just want certain areas to tone up a little bit more. My arms, of course, what woman doesn't want that? My stomach is a huge problem area for me, and also my thighs. But, again, I'm saying things that women are already, you know, like, yeah, we, we all want that. But um, let me tell you about uh, the diet, I guess. I got this... Um, from DIY HCG, uh, you know, like DIY as in do it yourself, HCG, and this is for the oral suspension. These are the drops that you put sublingual under your tongue, and um, you do it uh, three three times a day, ten drops. Um, I've read a few things now that saying that you should do it more a day, but less drops. Say, for instance five times a day, but you're going to do five drops, you know, so I, I don't know, but I'm just going to stick with protocol, and protocol is, um, you know, 10 drops a day, three times a day. Um, it comes with a oral syringe that you can just, you know, use this or use this. Um, I'm a little bit particular about putting things in my mouth, and to me that contaminates the uh, product you know, your germs in your mouth. So I'll probably be using the oral syringe and just wipe washing that out. And then I have a few extra syringes from um, uh, local drug stores. Um, I got these drops. And for, for you all that don't know what HCG stands for, for, it's the acronym for, okay, let me get this right, human <laughs> coronic gondotrophin. Yeah, don't quote me. I'll put the words right here. <laughs> and basically, this is the um, hormone that is introduced to your body when you become pregnant. And what this is doing, it's giving pretty much like a false positive. So your body is reading all these signs that you're pregnant. And so now it's like, okay, we have to take that fat and we have to use it towards the baby. But there's no baby. Um, but when you're releasing that fat, you're going to lose the weight. And uh, that, the drops plus a very low-calorie diet, 500 calories a day. Keep in mind that most people's meals, their one meal, whether it be breakfast, lunch, or dinner, is just 500 calories a day. 
So to eat, well, you're eating two meals and then like a breakfast, it, it's, it, it sounds a little bit crazy. So um, I, I guess we're going to go through this journey together. You're going to see me. Um, I, I'm trying to come up with some recipes. I'm doing a menu because that works best for me because I'm so everywhere. I'm about to start coaching volleyball and, and just so much is going on in my life um, that I need a something in my face that tells me, sit your butt down right now and do this. So, you know, I'm sure there's many people like that. That's what blackberries are for. Where's my phone? <laughs> so I'm sure there's people that are like me, too, that like, hey, hey, come do me. So that that's what I'm going to do. Uh, in addition to the drops, I went ahead and bought some B12. I like to work out. Working out makes me feel good. And even though I'm going to work out, I'm not going to do it to the extent that I normally do. Um, so I'll probably do about maybe 30 minutes of cardio, just light walking every day. And that's just for me to feel good. Um, I'm really, really excited. And um, did I tell you all? I'm not sure if I did. Yeah, I said 150. I said I wanted to be about 150-ish. So if I lose 20 pounds, I'd be over the moon. I'd be over the moon. That put me in the 150 range, and um, right now, I am a, probably a gene size of 11, 12, 13, 14. It just really depends on the genes. Um, yeah, I think that's enough personal information I'm going to tell you for now about my weight. Um, I'm going to have some pictures at the end of this, and um, it's it's a, it's. It's a little embarrassing. I, I just have to be upfront and truthful. It's it's a little embarrassing that I've let myself get to this point, and I think we all have to come to that realization like, whoa, enough is enough. And right now, this is my realization, and I am doing something about it. That's what the HCG diet means to me. Um so if you're interested, let me throw this out there. I am no way affiliated with DIYHCG.com at all. This is me, not them, me. Um, but if you're interested, you know, I would suggest them. They were suggested to me, so I would suggest them. I'm going to pass the suggestion down to you all. Again, the website is DIY Delta Indigo, yes. <laughs> HCG.com. Um so we should have an interesting, I'm going to do the 23 days. We should have an interesting 23 days. I'm not going to do a daily blog, but I will try to do about two to three days, um, depending on my schedule. So, again, this should be very interesting, and uh, I just want to thank you all for listening to me rant. <laughs> bye, fellas. Bye, fellas.